Hey folks, Quilly Teen here, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play The Sims 4. And we have just gotten married. Hopefully there are no more uh, technical problems at this end. Right at the end it was getting super mega choppy, but right now we are fully okay. Game is running properly, no crashes. Oh, I didn't actually uh, save there, so let's, uh, let's go ahead and throw that in. Just to make sure. Uh, people have also pointed out that when we're in building mode over here, because it's not our lot, it's just a community lot, we actually have unlimited money to decorate these places, so... Um, that's good. So with that in mind, what I want to do, I'm actually going to take some time to like do a proper sort of, I, I want to add a kitchen to the, oh, there's music over here. How nice is that? I want to add a kitchen to our, um, to our museum here so that they can host these parties. So uh, I actually want to like add a little room somewhere or something, make, make a proper little kitchen so that they can cater these events. Uh, it's really nice over here, but I'm thinking like we could build a little add-on over here. You know, maybe, maybe I won't worry about it, but I will go ahead and make like the fancy kitchen. Um, they do have, uh, they have pre-built rooms, yeah? Pre-built little kitchens? How do we do this? Um, buy room. Wait, big the ceiling. Why are the ceiling so high? Uh, how do I get rid of this foundation? First, make the ceilings lower. Next, uh, foundations. Is it everything on the lot that gets changed? It's everything on the lot that gets changed. You know what? That's okay. Get rid of the foundation. Uh, finally, oh, there is a door, but it's on the wrong side. Let's take this door. And move it to over here. There we go. And uh, oh, we'll have to decorate the outside. Let's put a bit of a just a bit of a roof on there. We'll keep it quite low as well. I like doing these little roofs so they don't really get in the way too much. Bit of a roof. And then maybe a brick out outside, brick exterior. You can actually like make all these lots, uh, all these community lots from scratch if you want. Um, no, no, it's not very nice, is it? And I guess we can recolor things. Probably look nicer with just some big windows. What do we want? There you go. Just a little something like that. It's somewhere for the caterers to work. Assuming they actually showed up. All right. We got married! Yay! Oh, we need a, a wedding cake. Hold on. Uh, cake. Or is that what the caterer is for? How do we get wedding cake? I don't know. What's the royal wedding swag? Oh, it's just some coverings. Yeah, I don't know how we get our cake. I'm not going to fantasize about weddings. We can, uh... How come we can't... Can I just... Oh, it, it, they're just making drinks? Lovely. Let's have drinks. Oops, I did not mean to tab... Back to that. Oh yeah, he's just sitting there like making a ton of drinks. Cool. So I'll have some drinks. We'll have a toast. Hopefully we can have a golden quality wedding here. Um, wedding kick. Is it in, like in our inventory or something like that? No. No, that's build mode stuff. We don't have anything going on here. There's someone in the kitchen. And we did hire a caterer. Hmm. Whoa! Flaming drinks! Like the Flaming Homer. I 
got seven hours left to the wedding. We've got lots of time. Hmm. I assume it has to be baked. Don't you have the option to add a wedding topper and an existing cake? Yeah, but shouldn't someone else be cooking this for us? I mean, I can cook. I can cook a white cake. And then, yeah, throw a wedding topper on there. I guess maybe I'll have to. I should have cooked it at home and then um, brought it with me. Kind of weird. We're going to have the groom cook his own cake. Finish your drink first. Actually, no. Don't finish your drink first. You have a gourmet co kitchen to cook in. All right. Have drinks is finished. Good. Eat food. Well, once we have a cake, we'll be able to eat that. All right, come on, bro. Don't fail me now. When you start, you're starting to get tired. No, unacceptable. Pause. You are going to go to the reward store. We are going to buy a sleep replacement potion. Bam. No tiredness for you. Add wedding topper, 25 bucks. I haven't drank the potion yet, but I was going to wait until he gets a little bit more sleep desperate. Um, okay, pause. No, pause again. We're going to take the wedding cake. We're going to bring it out. And put it on the bar? No? We'll put it right over here. That'll be fine. Okay. We're going to cut the wedding cake. People are already eating food, somehow. Hopefully, is he going to join her for the cutting of the wedding cake? What? Wait, what? <laughs> Apparently not! What?! There's no moment where they sit there and eat their wedding cake together? Come on. Share wedding cake. Oh! Oh, no, they are... I don't know. I don't understand what's going to happen. Oh! 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 That's so nice. Oh, okay. That makes me happy. That's nice. He's like, I am fat. I enjoy wedding cake. Okay, go over there and get your own piece. Get a proper piece of wedding cake. They're super happy from being married and engaged, everything like that, and cutting the wedding cake, which he didn't actually get to participate in, apparently, because, you know, why would they cut a cake together? All right, well, when we finish all eating food, we, uh, theoretically, we should be getting a gold quality wedding. We still got lots of time left to it. Six hours left. Everyone's grabbing cake. Everyone should complete the eat food criteria. Very happy. Aww. He's just normal happy. We did hire a caterer, right? Like, I'm confused. But we can use this lot for more weddings now that we've got this thing. Maybe it's because we didn't have that there, but we did get a bartender. Maybe I didn't hire... I don't know. I'm confuzzled. Yay, ate food! Good quality wedding! Yes! We could actually end the, the thing right now, but I don't think there's any good reason to do that. Uh, we can probably just keep the sleep replacement, though. We'll keep going until he gets, like, desperate for sleep, and then we'll call it done. Oh, we need music. They should dance together at their wedding. Shouldn't they? I think they should. Let's put a stereo system near the bar. Or we could just put speakers sort of in the walls, or, or what? I'm not sure. Oh, you know what? We could put the the Grammy phone. That'll actually fit in a little bit in the uh, the environment. But I'm not sure where to physically place it. We don't almost need some sort of counter. I don't want to have it be on the ground. I don't know. Maybe 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 no music. It's a daytime wedding. It's not really. You don't dance at daytime weddings. Random joggers coming through the thing. That's fine. Oh, they're coming for drinks. Sure, it's an open bar. Actually, I think he just ordered his own, so that's good. Eating at separate tables at the wedding. It's just a more casual thing. I don't know. Yeah, we could have set up, like, more dining tables or something. I could have... Yeah, actually, it might have been a good idea to redo all these tables over here. Like, all, like, white linen tables and things like that. And just have it be an ideal location for wedding. I do like this little kitchen that's just sort of tucked up under this tree over here in this one corner. For catering jobs. I think that's actually quite swell. I'm going to have to uh, just decorate a bunch of lots and make my own sort of social lots. You, he's asleep. You, all right, listen, dude. 
Don't be ridiculous. Hey, what? Why don't you, uh, where's your wife? She's over here. Oh, she's in the flower. Of course she is. God, why would you expect anything else from her? Why don't you, uh, why don't you go over there? And, uh, why don't you embrace her? Oh, where are you guys going? Well, you can dance over here. No, we can practice. We can't dance. Oh, there's already a, a bar over there. I didn't realize that. Listen. Whoa. Should screw this wedding. And just go and do something else. You know, like try for baby. I'm tired. He's pretty tired. Okay, let's uh, let's drink the potion. She needs to go to the washroom and stuff like that. You know what? Drink his potion. Go home with lots of energy. Let's try for baby. I like the look of the drink, though. It's kind of interesting. Oh, they're so cute. Ah, very flirty. Yeah. See, don't don't even need the uh their their room buff to do this. All right, stop chatting, drink your drink before you pass out. There we go, now they both need to go to the bathroom. All right, we're gonna call it quits. End early, we've got a gold medal event, that's going to be fine. Boom. Guests were so impressed by the festivities, they left your Sims a few appliances and decorative items in their household inventory. Lovely, let's, um, let's go home. Oh, that's funny. They've both gone home, but I'm still physically at this lot. And yeah, you can command people to do things. It's kind of awesome. Um, sure, but how do I go home? Switch control to LS. There we go. That's kind of weird. I didn't realize that would happen. They both leave the lot and I would still be there. But yeah, there's a thing to do. Bride and groom leaving early is entirely reasonable. You know, everyone else can go and party, and the bride and groom, they've got other things they want to do before they get too tired to do it. Mostly each other. All right, they're both home. Yes, excellent. She's reading a book. No, that's not what we want to do. We want to try for baby with bam. Even wants to woohoo. He's all set for it. She wants to schedule a date and get another requirement. Wedding cake is boosting flirty, apparently. Uh, we got bills. She wants to level up charisma. I love the way their portraits change. Although, that's a bit, like, creepy look. Oh, uh, I should have given them a lingerie outfit for this. I wasn't thinking. Yeah, we should actually change their, uh, their sleeping gear. Although, maybe once they get fit again. <laughs> oh, what a lovely day. They woohooed, they proposed, they got married, and then they're woohooing for a baby all in the same day. I wonder if there's an achievement for, like, woohooing multiple times in one period. <laughs> Titillating banter. All right, we're going to have to find out if things happened. She wants to tell a dirty joke. Yeah, I was gonna say neither one of them should be particularly sleepy. She should uh should take a thoughtful shower, perhaps. And you why don't you go in on an endurance run over here? Is the TV on? Watch uh watch sports. There we go. So let's check our household inventory. Oh my god, Zoe, you wanna give us like a, a day? Before you start, uh, like, muscling. Oh, look, we got lots of stuff. We got a centerpiece, a wedding pillar. Why would we need a wedding pillar now? Like, after you complete a wedding, you have this thing that is good for weddings. We got a tea magic personal brewer. Brew all your favorite teas at the touch of a button. I need one of these! Includes handy features like a programmable timer, cup, and pot settings, lemon twist, and a spoonful of sugar option. That's amazing! We need a bigger kitchen. We need a bigger house. 
the Food Annihilator. Our microwave will blast your leftovers with radiation so thoroughly and with such intensity that no living thing should approach it for decades. Other microwaves just raise your food's temperature slightly, but when you want food that's been permanently sterilized, there's only one name in the business, the Food Annihilator. Okay, also this is a good way to kill your Wi-Fi. And a modernist paper towel dispenser. When you desire a paper towel dispenser with severe yet functional style, look no further. Okay, well, we need we need a, a bigger kitchen. We need lots of things going on before we do that. I'm wondering, should we just, like, move to a new lot entirely? I don't know if we have that much money. But we could sell our house, move to another lot with a better layout, or we could just start changing things relatively dramatically. Hmm. Go away, Zoe. No one wants you here. God, I'm so cruel. Speaking of, um, you've got everything you need. Excellent. You don't need any more friends or anything. You just need level three of guitar or comedy. We've got that. Wants to, we should be practicing our music before we have to work again in a couple of days, but that's fine. You're working out. I think he may have already gotten ever so slightly slimmer. I'm not sure. We'll see. Is she still out there? Well, I suppose she, we could make friends. Oh. Wants to talk about dreams with someone. Oh, that's so nice, because she's very inspired. We'll talk about dreams. She could use more friends. And he's already friends with Zoe, so it sort of makes sense. Um, You're going to talk about dreams? There we go. Okay, now you've done. Okay, channel surf together. All right, he's done exercising. All right, stop whining. Just go. Just go take a shower or something. Yeah, there you go. Take your bath. You're stinky. You're feeling very energized though, which is good. You want to hip bump someone? Well, maybe not right now. No, no, he's just back to happy. They've had a really lovely day. I wonder how long it takes before she starts showing. I wonder how the baby thing works. Feeling great, completely satisfied, just married, engaged. It's the shower. Wants to enthuse about the outdoors? We can do that. I'll be under here somewhere. Enthuse about new show. Isn't it? It's like different every time. It's not going to be funny. Well, more people have come over. It's, it, it's not time for us to have a party. It's nice that we have a little casual discussion over here, but... Play an instrument. Plant something when we're not going to start planting. We actually need to go weed. I'm really sorry. I feel bad. But we're kind of tired and everything. Tell you what, I'm going to have to ask you to leave. We're going to have to uh, weed some plants. And potentially water things. And then we're going to go to bed. We're tired. I wonder if we have to woohoo multiple times trying for baby. Alright, he's having a blast. He's also kind of hungry. I think we've got some food left in here. Yeah, some pancakes. Why don't you do that? We might, might, we might make you work out some more. You're not tired because you drank that drink. Wow, you have a lot of energy. You're pretty good to go. Uh, we do need for your work, we need to make you practice again. So we may actually should do that. Let's practice our music a little bit just for work stuff. Then we'll try to keep making him work out. More evolutions, too? Wow. Well, let's hope she can get all this done before she has to go to sleep. Having my plants spread out like this doesn't mean a little bit of extra walk time, which is unfortunate. He's almost done. There we go. He's completed that. I'm gonna have to work out some more. Oh, she's so tired. But evolving plants doesn't take a lot of work. Come on, you can do it. A little bit more. You're okay. 
paid off. Mushroom plants increased in quality. Spinach plants increased in quality. Alright, now go to sleep. You deserve it. You had a very full day. Are we at excellent quality yet? Or at nice? And very nice. Is that as good as we've gotten anywhere? I wonder if there's a category above that. It's good. Oh, well, they might occasionally drop in quality if they've been sitting around with weeds and not being watered in a while or something like that. I bet you that's what's going on. Do, 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 do. He's still doing the thing where he's like falling on the treadmill. So, he probably can't get promoted in one day, but otherwise he's going to be okay. Maybe if we work hard? No, it's probably still not possible to get a one-day promotion. Yeah, we gotta figure out what to do with their house and the money and things. Did she ever publish her other book? I don't think so. No! Uh, pay bills and sell the book to the publisher. The Plumbot's Dream of Electric Sheep. And then the next book will be something about... Uh, it'll be a traveling book. Level 4, he can perform box on the punching bag, heavy lifting on the workout machine. Well, let me start to do something like that. How you looking? Mm, still kind of pot-bellied. But he's running a lot better now. Oh, we can do energized workout. Let's do that. Probably better than a regular endurance run. I mean, she's going to need to exercise, too. Okay, we've got some uh, some plantains. So this whole load is going to go into the fridge. Although what I should do then, uh, we'll still sell the bluebells. Let's just check to see what we've got a lot of. There's no way to just split stacks, is there? All, right, all this parsley. I just want, like... I guess what I can do is... Actually, take most of it and just put some of it back. That makes sense. Like all these mushrooms. Grab that and then just drag in some mushrooms over here. I should check the fridge before adding things to it. And then sell. Throw some spinach in there. These look like leeks. Does it look like that to anyone else? There we are. Sell that. Some parsley. Not very exciting this step, but... And sell that stack. We're making pretty good money off the gardening. It is a lot of work, but there's some cash to be made. Bit of lag there while we... Uh... Move goods. All that. And then carrots. There's probably a key to split, but I think I tried like control and shift and alt before. There we go. He's still falling. That's her. She's going to need to pee and eat as soon as she gets up. <gasps> Take pregnancy test! We'll do that. There we go. We'll do that first. Meanwhile, you... There you go. I'm gonna... You, you can stop your workout. It's fine. I'll get you to pay the bills. Mop like mad. There we go. Well energized. Oh, you're not energized anymore. I'll just mop like normal then. And then take a take a thoughtful shower. Okay, she's gonna pee. Assuming that that does her bladder need, it does. But she's taking her pregnancy test. I love the fact that it's there. Like that's a great option. That's cool. I don't think that existed in previous versions of The Sims. All right, how long does it take to pee on a stick? Eating for two! Congratulations, Victoria's expecting! There's gonna be a new addition to this household! Poof! Oh my god, and she got like... She got the belly right away. She's, uh, she's preggers, eating for two. She's in the second trimester... Oh, in 24 hours, she'll be in the second trimester. She's super hungry right now. Well, by all means, go and eat! Manja manja!
There's more pancakes over there. Oh, I think she was already setting up for that. Well, with that bombshell, I think we are going to uh, wrap up this episode. As soon as he's done the shower, I'm actually going to have him cook some more because that was the last thing out. Uh, clean out the spoiled food. And we'll get you to cook something else, hopefully with something with fresh ingredients. Some fish tacos. Plantain pancakes. Oh, that sounds quite nummy. Black and white cookies. Spaghetti with mushrooms. French toast with plantains. Let's do the French toast. We'll do another family size thing of that. But yeah, we'll end this episode. We got the baby on the way, so I'm going to be talking to Twitch chat in between episodes. We're going to get a baby name. We don't know the gender yet, so um, we'll have to... I guess we'll have to figure that out. Damn. Damn. We probably won't know until until it happens, which is always something that they do on television, right? They're like, no, we can't know the, the baby's gender until birth because we have to save it for a dramatic episode. And it's like, I mean, I'm like Mr. Practical. I'm like, that's stupid. It'd be so much more convenient if you knew, we knew ahead of time. We could start brainstorming names a little bit better, for example. Can I do that? Can I go for like a sonogram and figure out my baby's gender? Yes, no. You didn't flush toilet? Really? Really, Victoria? Good God. All right, folks, I will see you guys next time.